turned 10. All right, which when the king had granted and he had gotten into his hand the rule, he forthwith brought his own nation to Greekish fashion. And the royal privileges granted a special favor to the Jews by the means of John, the father of Eupopolemus, who went ambassador to Rome for amity and aid, who took away and put him down the governments which were according to the law, he brought up new customs against the law. For he built gladly a place of exercise under the tower itself and brought the chief young men under his subjection and made them wear a hat. Now such was the height of Greek fashion and increase of heathenish, heathenish manners the exceeding profaneness of Jason, that ungodly wretch, and no high priest. And that is a Greek fashion. And that's, that's against the uh, Lord. You got it in the scripture, man. Right? Okay. Uh, All right, back in 2 Peter 2 and uh, 20. For if after they have escaped the pollutions of the world through the knowledge of the Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shai and Mashiach, they are again entangled therein and overcome. The latter end is worse with them than the beginning. Why? Why, Why is the latter end worse than the beginning? Based on what the brother read in uh, Matthew, above it, unclean spirits come into you. So now that you are no longer useful, what is... What, your, your, your vessel, what good is it for now? And these these, these, these uh, unclean spirits need a place to have it. Yeah. Yeah. So since the, the, the Holy Spirit that was once there is no longer there, I might as well send these other spirits in here. Give them, give them a home. Give them a, 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 a residency. <laughs> and now the spirits get to have an electric daisy carnival in your, in, in, in your brain. That's what happens, and then you become worse and worse, deceiving and being deceived. That's what happens, which is a, which is a scary thing. Is hey, like the script, that's what the scripture say is a, uh, a, a terrible thing to fall into the hands of the living power, man. But that can happen. It can happen to any one of us up here, man. If we get too proud, if we don't take a correction, a brother might see something in the spirit that you don't see, and he might. You know, he, he, he's gonna bring it to your, your awareness. You might want to take heed to that, man, because that, or you could wax proud and fall into that condemnation. You don't want to be a, 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 a novice, being lifted up with pride and falling into the condemnation of the devil. And that's what happened with, with that guy. He was a novice, and he just jumped up to this level, and he ain't never seen this type of praise before, and that fucked his head up. Now you can't say nothing to this dude. You start making uh, uh, proud, boastful statements like it is a sin to to to, uh, to disagree with me. You know, because I'm the because I'm the chief priest, and, and, and he's really being deceived in his mind because he thinks that the Most High Yahweh Shai is dealing with him. But the, the, the Most High not dealing with you. You coming in that spirit of. Uh, conflict, the spirit of uh, 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 vain glory. That's not the spirit of the Lord. You're not humble. You ain't meek. You know, you prideful, you boastful. You are disobedient to your parents, uh, your spiritual, your spiritual parents, uh, the apostles, and el uh, elders who taught you. You haven't surpassed them. That's what in his mind he thinks he's surpassed the apostles and the elders. Yeah, he believes that. Oh, really? He really does believe that. Like you talk about apostles to harsh and retired. Yada yada yada. No, ain't no retiring for this. Uh verse 24 of they I see. Do I read this? 24, 21, yeah. 
For it had been better for them not to have known the way of righteousness than after they have known it to turn from the holy commandment delivered unto them. But it had been. That's not a BCDC crime. That's yeah. not a BCDC yeah, yeah, yeah. crime. Yeah, yeah. But it has happened unto them according to the true proverb that dog is turned to his own vomit again and so that was that was washed to her wallowing in the mire. That's a good killer. Now you want to clean again. Yeah. And them demons, they, they just like parasites. Yeah. Them demons will feed off of whatever uh, yeah. or fleshly desire that you got. Whatever, yeah, whatever you feed them. Whatever you, you know? feed them, they're gonna feed, they, they gonna feed right over that. Yeah. You just your behavior is just like there's no cure for you like that. Your degenerate behavior can just continue to feed those parasites and they grow and, and it's just like a, a, a wicked a, a demon that just, just grows and, 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 and a, this demon pop on and this demon and before you know it, you got, you know, multiple a, a legion of demons in you. There's, there's certain parasites that uh, once they take over a body, they control that body. They, 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 they control the host. We see the host. We see the insects that have no shell, but it's a parasite in them that's controlling them still moving. Like that, um, what was it they got shot? Oh, the raccoon? Yeah, yeah, the raccoon. The raccoon, we see a video of raccoon got shot point blank in the head multiple times. Yeah, kind, kind. Yeah. Rabbit, the rabbit. Yeah, kind. Yeah, that's a super demon, bro. Rabies. That's what happens with these dudes. And they're no longer controlling themselves, man. The demons that have taken uh, that have taken over, they're the ones controlling them. Okay? They're, now they're just complete reprobates. They don't even know it. You can see the countenance is all extra darkened. Like a... Uh, 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 that do a, a war, this countess is completely different. Yeah. It's dark now. You put on all that extra weight. But you know he just he he just he lost himself, man. That's a that's a, that's horrible. But 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 that's a that's a, 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 a classic description of purple bait that get casted away. That's what happens to him, man. That's the process. You don't want to fall into that, that uh, condemnation. But the Lord has, and all these men, the Lord gave them humble time. Constantly giving them warning, constantly giving them uh, rebuke, correction. Because the Lord is long suffering. He doesn't want to just, just flat out put you to death. He's going to offer you a way out. He's going to, he's going, going back to seek uh, you. The Lord is trying not to take your ass out, man. Look at Nate. We thought Nate was about to go a couple years back. Now he's back playing playing games again. I got Proverbs 16 and uh, 18 in the GST. Pride leads to destruction and arrogance to downfall.
from all your transgressions. So iniquity shall not be your ruin. Cast away from you all from you all your transgressions, whereby ye have transgressed, and make you a new heart and a new spirit. For why will ye die, O house of Israel? Let me say, a lot of times these, these other these other leaders, false prophets, if you will, false teachers, they ain't let the old man go. They ain't been renewed as a new as a new creature. They still they, like they got the fullness of the old creature still in it. The reverse parts of the old creature right. still in it. And then you can put it to the side for a little bit, help to help it make you tall or whatever, or make you look all okay. But then eventually, it's going to show itself. Well, really what sorts you up. That you ain't really, that that old man hasn't has been fully washed away. Continuing, it says, For I have no pleasure in the death of him that died, saith the Lord Power. Wherefore, turn yourselves and live ye. It is. <laughs> the double second is, uh, how do you say it? Uh, if you get the victory, uh, if you do, uh, what do you say? If you, if you be overcome, you should uh, suffer as, as, as I have said. But if you get the victory, it's like the seventh chapter or the fourteenth chapter. I always do. Yeah. But it's the same thing. You, the, the victory and the real battle of this thing is fighting yourself, keeping the demons off, you, staying in the spirit, and not letting your flesh make them important judgment calls. That you really have to uh, to be in the spirit moving with, especially in, in the worst times to get in more and more and more. You got it? Second Ezra 7 57. Seven. <laughs> and then answered he me and said, This is the condition of the battle which man that is born upon the earth shall fight. Yep. That if he be overcome, he shall suffer as thou hast said. Yep. But if he be overcome get by the wickedness, the old man, the flesh, you know. But if you get the victory, you shall receive the Meaning, how do you get the victory? You gotta, uh, uh, we were told it, um, if a man, uh, forsake not his mother and father, uh, uh, uh lands and children and, and, and all his own life also, you cannot be my disciple. Yeah. So you gotta put all these other things and prefer the truth before all things. You gotta start with the base of the truth. To, to discern everything that you're doing and the way that you're living, you gotta, you gotta take that uh, uh, out of the word, out of the guidelines of the word, and build yourself that way. Or guide yourself from that. You sit from that. He shall receive the thing that I say. That, that's salvation, okay? For three. First John 5 and 4. For whatsoever is born of the most high overcometh the world. And this is the victory that overcometh the world even our faith. Who is he that overcometh the world, but he that believeth that Yahweh Shai is the Son of the Most High? So, hey, that's, you're going to get this victory by what? By your faith. Believing in, there, believing in all the things that were written in the Scriptures and applying it. Applying it to your everyday walk, your life. Using it to, 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 to fight off you know, uh, uh, these, these left hand spirits, okay. you know, fighting that battle, man. With the thoughts, imaginations. Huh. That, fighting off these temptations, man. That's the only thing that the spirit of Yahweh Shin is the only thing the defense you have against those. Huh. You know? You gotta have that breastplate of righteousness, the uh, shield of faith, the helmet of salvation, man. Yeah, the feet shot with the Put on the whole That's armor of the Most High, man. You got the sword of the spirit, which yeah. is the word. Yeah. That, that's that's the whole equipment, man. You put that down. You put down your armor. You put your sword down. At any moment, that could cost you in the war. You could end up being a casualty. Our own. You going to war, but oh, I forgot my uh, came. I forgot my my helmet. Right. So you about to go out there and battle without your helmet. <laughs> right. And get a spear sent through your skull. You know? Yeah, yeah. You're just a gash that a better deflected off the helmet. Yeah, now you got a gash yeah. inside of your head, ear missing and shit. Bro, yeah. you bleed out. 
Well, he might be a scout, but I don't know. 